These types of things happen. It gets frustrating, you tend to get upset. Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at the 80% Arms GST9. I've been having some extraction issues. It gets stuck, the case gets stuck in the chamber. It hasn't been extracting very well. But it's been a couple years now since I've had this out. I was looking forward to having some good range time with it. Now the one thing that I changed is I put a Holosun 407C on, on there because it comes with an RMR footprint optic ready. They all do. And I put a Holosun 407C on there. And I sighted it in pretty decent. And I'm excited to get this out. But I don't like those ejection issues. The case gets stuck in the chamber. You already saw it. It happened twice. So I cleaned it up. Because I took a few shots yesterday. And came out today. And I'm still having... The same issues, and I changed the ammo. That was Blazer Brass 115 grain ball ammo. It has a four inch fluted barrel, a full pick rail, gas pedals on each side. But one of the things I really like is that this grip texturing is, is nice, but it's not a back strap, it's actually a module because they offer another module that goes down about a half inch further and you can fit the Glock 17 round mags. This right here is a 15 round Glock 19 mag, but the 17 round mag, so it would replicate a Glock 45 or a 19X. I like it that it's optic ready. See those scalloped serrations on the top strap of the slide? That's pretty cool too if you want to uh, charge it off your, your pant leg or your boot. I don't even know if that'll work. I, I could do it with my optic, not my favorite choice. Same Glock trigger. Love the gun. Not sure about those ejection issues. Let me load it up and we'll try it some more. All right, round two. Let's see what happens here. Always important to switch out the ammo before you blame the gun. But now it's happened with both types of ammo. So let's see here. And right there is the issue. I'll drop the mag. I have to lock the slide all the way back. I'll drop the mag and there is a case that's stuck in there. And there it is, that was stuck in the chamber. We'll try it again. And it's happening again. So these types of things happen. It gets frustrating, you tend to get upset. I haven't had this gun out in two years and it performed flawlessly, now all of a sudden I'm having some extraction and ejection issues. I have to take a deeper look into it, uh, above and beyond just the ammo. But let me see what goes on here. We'll start one-handed. All right, and that time it rolled through three rounds. I did clean and lube it prior to coming to the range today. Love the features. Love the performance when it's working better. Right now, I find myself just a little bit frustrated over what, what's going on. I'm really not sure. It hasn't been abused at all. Just kind of sat in the safe for a while. The gun charges fine. Doesn't get caught up in the chamber or anything like that. It just doesn't eject too well. Here we go. And... That was fine, ran through the whole mag. So I'm going to change my location because somebody wants to shoot rifle back there. So I'm gonna change my location so he's not shooting behind me. Don't ever let somebody shoot behind you. Very unsafe. 
And I'm doing that because I already talked to the guy. Very cool guy, so I want to do this. And then we're going to load it up and try again. All right, I changed my location. It's just the right thing to do. Anyhow, I have 15 rounds loaded up. I'm going to take five shots just like I was. And then if those go fine, I'm going to mag dump the next 10. To see if this thing is doing any better. Let's see how it goes. I was just getting ready to mag dump and look at what happened. Another round that was not extracted or ejected and it falls out. All right, let's try mag dumping eight or nine rounds. And had another issue. So I'm not gonna stay out here and just burn ammo because it's not gonna work itself out. There's clear, clearly a problem here. And the problem is something that, I don't know. Some people would say, well, it's clearly that, but um, I have to take a deeper look. It was cleaned and oiled and everything else. Get out of there. There it is. What do I have? Two rounds maybe. Let's see. We'll go the small target to the left. And to the right. Uh, where's my dot? There. That's it. So it's silly just to burn ammo for no specific purpose. The same issues happening. You're going to have frustrating times at the range. Sometimes you can't hit your target. If you make videos, sometimes you can't talk. Other times you have issues with the gun. Whatever the case, we move forward because we're champions like that. That's what I'm going to do. And I know that's what you will do as well if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe